Hi everybody, Jen Fisher here. Okay, so after I po posted a couple mold videos, uh, people are asking about what to look for and some symptoms that you may have that would alert you that that could be uh, the possible issue. So there's a lot of symptoms and everybody responds different to it. Some people get no symptoms. My husband literally had no symptoms. I had the worst symptoms because I um, had a lower immune system. So it attacked that and created the autoimmune. But in general, there are a lot of asthma symptoms, runny nose, getting sick a lot. Um, there's a stomach distress. Uh, many clients that have SIBO, Candida, um, and they just can't seem to get feeling better. And so that underlying cause of all of these random symptoms that you have that like they kind of can't pinpoint it as to what is wrong with you, a lot of times it's mold. I would say um, the majority of clients that I get from a couple doctors that refer me, they all have SIBO and Candida and sure enough, she'll test them for mold and that's their underlying cause. Autoimmunity is a huge one. So hopefully that helps. If you guys have any other questions, just let me know. I'm happy to make a video and answer them for you. Talk to y'all soon, bye.